It really doesn't. Well, it doesn't displease me, it displeases him because he's a fat idiot. Lord Bolton will have uh, I'll send him a raven letting him know a forester man killed one of his own. Yeah, you, blah, Lord blah, Forrester, blah. To my face and denied me my justice. Then we'll see whose word is law. Sure. You're a craven, Lord Whitehill. Yep. He's a fucking craven, whatever that means. I have a feeling we're not going to be seeing the last of him yet. Him. I was wrong about your son, my lady. Oh God! Up Shut up. Like true lord. You were brave. Master. Of course I was. It's me, me controlling him. We've been over this before. Prepare a raven. We need to send word to Mira in King's Landing. Of course. Once. So we met Roderick. We met the dad, Lord Forrester. We met Ethan. We met. uh... Garrett, Your sister we're gonna meet Mira. We haven't met Asher yet. We met she has uh, the youngest one. And Lady Marjorie's betrothal to the king may be enough to keep the Boltons at bay. Hey, hey, hey! It's presented to her as it should be. Oh, for fuck's sakes! This is not going to be fun. Really, it isn't. Ah, uh, shit. Asher sent me this coin to remember him. What a strange place, Essos. Eh, uh, we'll probably meet Asher. It was very kind of Lady Marjorie to give this to me. <sighs> For fuck's sakes. It once belonged to Lady Elena. Elena? Who's Elena? For fuck's sakes. I really don't know what to say. Father. Much excitement here in King's <clears throat> Landing for the coming wedding. Lady About that he is not alive anymore. He did, he, he did. Although I know it would be impossible under the circumstances. Oh, I for miss fuck's sakes. You, and I look forward to the day you can. Holy shit. Even made this for me. Uh, sorry, well, I, I had to burp. I didn't want to burp right into the mic, and I didn't. Ham. Hey, hey. Wonders made by man, by Lomas mm. Longstrider. Oh, for fuck's sake. A gift from Lada Roderick. Roderick. Which I think he's dead, so there's to only someday. Asher. We're gonna count to, uh, Garrett in there, so Mira, Garrett, Asher. I, I was gonna say Roland, but it doesn't seem today. late. So the three kids that we saw, Mira, that's four. Asher. So there's about six or seven left. Seven left, because we're counting it Lady. Me to even ask this of you. But you must appeal to Lady Marjorie to intervene on our behalf. Oh, for fuck's she sakes. Is our best hope and can be a powerful ally, especially now when your family so desperately needs her. <sighs> Sorry about that. I had a yawn, I don't know why. One moment. Yeah. What do you want? Oh, sorry, milady. I, I didn't mean to disturb you. I can come back later if you'd like. Ah, uh, shit. Later would be best. Of course. Now you give him a chance of being like, of course. Just close the fucking door. Ah, uh, shit. Lady Marjorie, you're early. <coughs> I was hoping there would be time for us to talk. <coughs> something we must discuss. Uh, 
have a feeling this is going to be really... I don't know the right word to use. A friend than as my handmaid. A dear friend, in fact. Thank you, my lady. Uh, and you know uh, excuse you me, I don't know where that keeps coming from. Family. I feel your pain as if it were my own. What you've suffered is beyond imagining. I need your help, my lady. Of course you do. Of course. And I will help you in any way I can. Ah, uh, shit. We must attend to first. Lady Mira there are limits to what is I can us. see, especially uh, landing now that I am to be queen. To have a handmaiden from the north whose family fought for Rob Stark. What? What? It raises questions at a time I can least afford. <coughs> herself cornered me this morning huh. beside the royal set. Jesus, criminy Krabbis. She mentioned the northern girl in my service, and she painted you a traitor. She was very pleased with herself. Of course. I'm not a traitor. Yep, I am not a traitor. Of course not. It's only an excuse to torment you, and by extension, me. Of she course, of course. An audience. She wants an apology of some sort. Oh, not she can kiss know, my fucking ass. She's waiting for us now, and I promised I would bring you to her. I wouldn't ask this of you if it were not important. I Does Paul you have to mean something? Any conflict with Cersei with the wedding? So oh, that explains it. Talking Cersei. You ask, my lady. From what I've heard, Cersei she is a plain out. You. See you next Tuesday. Her. Tell her what she wants to hear. <sighs> See if the Queen Regent is ready to receive us. Sure. Oh boy. This is gonna be a task and a half. You'll be fine. I know you will. You yep, I thing, will. But you must say another. Hey, yeah, boy. This is. Good luck. Don't need luck. I'm gonna try to do the best I can. Ah, shit. Ahem. God, I gotta burp again. One sec. Excuse me, jeez. That, I could taste the Powerade. Sorry, I was using one hand to control it and just scratch my mustache with the other. Ah, oh, Lady Marjorie. Ah, Lord Tyrion. Lord Tyrion. Your Grace? Hey, boy. Hey, boy, hey, boy. With your permission, allow me to introduce Lady Mira of House Forrester. Sure, we can do that. I don't know, I'm, I'm just saying weird. Hmm. Yet not honored enough to kneel, I see. Random House shit. House Forrester is a loyal to the king. Are they? I beg your pardon, Your Grace. I wasn't talking to you. Hey, I want boy. to hear from the girl. Is your family loyal to the king? Perhaps sure. To the new Lord Forrester. House Forrester's loyalty to the crown never wavers, Your Grace. It never does. Hey. And yet, for centuries the Foresters have been loyal bannermen to House Stark. For fuck's sake, this a house of traitors. I mean, say that, but yeah, it's a. Uh, north, we all served at the pleasure of the king. No idea. Clever girl. As I hit my pop, my boom arm. For her own good. The girl did say their loyalty was unwavering. Yep. She has a talent for equivocation. Yet God, I shut really up, Cersei. You are such a fucking pea-brained mongoloid. Yes, Your Grace. Absolutely. Hey. I see. Despite the fact Roose Bolton allied with Walder Frey, if yeah, it was me, I'd find it difficult to so quickly forgive the men who killed my father. <sighs> old allegiances are not easily abandoned, but now I can care less about old allegiances. To rebuild and forge new alliances. Like I said before, I said in other ones, I deleted, not even deleted this one side of the family just treat me one way and the other treat me the next. It's 
But tiring, I guess, is the right word because dad's out of the family treat me like, oh, he's stupid and they should put me in the corner. I know I'll never be the same. Shook my world so hard again. Wish I washed away my sins. He's a dead man walking, blank staring in his eyes. Should have given up on the ones I trust. Never should have been surprised when they shot.